more and more often I've been seeing people declare width 100 VW on things that really don't require it and it could actually be causing problems that you don't even realize. For example, you have a hero area and you want it to take up the entire viewport, so people just throw a width 100 VW, a height 100 VH. That can work a little bit, but as soon as there's more content, you run the risk of side scrolling on any device that doesn't have a floating scroll bar. And that's because VW doesn't look at the scroll bar itself, it looks at the entire viewport, including the space there, so it actually causes a little bit of overflow if there isn't a floating scroll bar. My hero is a div, it's already a block level element, it's already taking up the full space that I wanted it to. And I know sometimes the 100VH can be problematic, especially on mobile. One solution to this would be to use a DVH, which is just starting to gain browser support now, but it takes into account the UI elements that move in and off the screen when you're on mobile. Now, because browser support is not perfect yet, you could always do a 100VH on the original one and then follow that up with a DVH, or you could use some other versions of height as well to pull off what you're looking for. 